Are you contemplating a move to Virginia? Are you guessing about maybe what neighborhood you're looking at? Well, today we're at Lee's Park here in Fredericksburg, Virginia, and we're gonna break down not only the house we're standing in, but also the neighborhood. So like I said, we are in Fredericksburg, Virginia, here in Lee's Park, which is right on Spotsylvania Parkway. The cool thing about this place is you're about 10 minutes from the VRE, maybe even a little bit less. The VRE is a train station that goes up north. A lot of commuters take it. We are also within five minutes of 95. So anybody commuting north or south, that's our major roadway that comes through Fredericksburg. For shopping, you couldn't ask for better. You're within three minutes of Cosmo Corner. It's legitimately right at the end of this road. Now Lee's Park also has some great amenities. We have a clubhouse, a pool, three tennis courts, walking trails, and five playgrounds for the children. So if you are commuting to DC, you're just a tad bit over an hour away. And the same for Richmond as well. I think it was an hour and a few minutes. So we're in a very prime location here. What's up guys, my name is Ben Kwan, I'm associate broker here in Virginia, and here I am with my buddy Eddie, who's been in the business a long time. We're at one of his listings, we're actually getting ready for an open house. So why don't you tell us a little bit about the house? So thanks Ben, thanks for having me today. This is a great uh, three level colonial. It's got three finished levels. So above grade, we have about 3,400 square feet. It is four bedrooms, three and a half baths, with a loft area upstairs, it's a sunroom, great. Lots of windows, lots of light coming in for the kitchen area, and it has a stamp concrete patio up. Great yeah. entertaining. So we're so, over 5,000 finished square feet in this house. It's one of the larger models. That's including the below That's grade as well, right? Grade. Any uh, any other bedrooms downstairs? No, no bedrooms okay. downstairs. All right, Eddie, what are we listed at? We are listed at 635. 635, okay. So on average, it looks like four bedroom, three and a half bath. So this house is gonna fit right in line with the average home in this neighborhood, right? Well, one thing about this house, it's one of the larger floor plans. It's gigantic. It is. It's because of loft upstairs, the full finished basement square footage because of the largest model. So, you know, this one does tend to be on the higher end. Oh, big time. Price-wise and size-wise. This house is what? 3,400 up. A whole nother thousand square feet we're talking about. So that definitely dictates a bigger price because on average, the sales price is 525 on average in this neighborhood. And this one's listed at what? 635. 635. So you can see about $100,000 difference, but about a thousand square foot difference which is right in line for our area about a hundred dollars square foot is what you kind of go for so and then again we talk about basements and stamped concrete there's a, a few other things that will dictate price but for the most part it's like a good rule of thumb all right eddie so that's going to wrap everything up here today thank you for having me out to your open house yeah i appreciate you being out this afternoon absolutely all right guys if you enjoy this kind of content i have a whole playlist dedicated to nothing but Spotsylvania. It's gonna have local attractions, it's gonna have some of my new construction projects, and of course, all the neighborhood breakdowns that I can do. So I have a few, we're gonna build this thing out, it's gonna be really good. I will link that at the end of this video for you guys to check out.